Hello and welcome back to yet another new unboxing video. So, basically the one before the booster box, the audio quality was bad because I didn't notice that my mic wasn't working, so it ended up using my phone mic instead. Darn, that was annoying. But anyway, today we'll be opening the Pokemon Center ETB. And of course, I'm not opening the normal ones because I want the, uh, the Pokemon Center version of this. Oh, wait. Oh my god. Oh, okay, okay, it's still here. I thought I saw the back and it was like, oh, th there's no... Yep, we still have the double Pokemon Center. I was thinking, what if they what if they did just, like, they give you just the Pokemon Center one here and then you have to buy the normal one if you want to get the normal version. Wow, that would be so... <laughs> that would be such an ass move, but... Somehow, I don't know why. I could see Nintendo doing that one day. But anyway, let's just get this open. Alright, we'll start off with the ancient one first. Because the way I do things, I like to leave the best for last. So, yeah, let's see on the card list. Honestly, this set has really, some really, really nice cards. I really like the set. I think this will, this is a card that will do very well in the long run. I do think it's quite underrated because everyone's been preparing for 4.5 and it's just after 151 so people haven't reloaded yet. But yes, I do think this is good. As I said in my booster box video, I said this was like Silver Tempest. Except Silver... Well, it's kind of like... Si oh, sh It fell, damn it. Centering is not great. I guess it's fine. Scream tail. Very nice. Now, where's the other one? Don't tell me it's in here. Nope. Okay. The code, the sleeves, it's pretty nice. And the other one is here. Why couldn't I drop the normal one, dude? Come on. <laughs> yes, very nice. We have the energies, uh, the uh, dice. Yep, follows the colour. We already have this colour before. Actually... Alright, let's start off with the 10 packs first. Hopefully, we can get some good things. Those were the sleeves. Actually, these days... Why does it always go opposite of the... <laughs> I was gonna say. I was gonna say, these, these days, the packs I've been opening of Paradox Rift the seal is very loose and it's really easy to open. I think that's a good thing. But I don't know if it affects the quality of the cards. Oh! Oh! oh. Wait, oh no, it's not. I thought that was a. I'm gonna have to sort this out later since I'm hoping that I can build a deck. But yeah, I do recommend, once again, if you are getting, if you are keeping ETBs, try to get the Pokemon Center ones because the one, the normal versions have lost quite a bit of their premium due to, uh, you know, this. <laughs> but yeah, I think we've seen most of these cards with the booster box, so let's speed it up a bit, shall we? see something, but I think it's just an EX. Yeah, mouse hold. Well, don't know if I can form a deck. Not even a single AR, dude. What the hell? Or IR in English. Why is it so damn hard to get? At least give me one AR. Oh, 
this is really good. No. We see you have a chance. A very good chance. Thank you. Oh, what's this? Terrestrialize. I mean, it's a hit, but I was hoping to not get a dupe. If it makes it into a meta deck someday, then I can use these bling chips. When I lose, at least I lose in style. <laughs> Really? Not a single AR? We're down to our last two packs and not a single AR to be found. What is this? Why are they rarer than full arts? <laughs> Should not be that way. But at least one, come on. At least. Yes, we got one. Ooh, ground on. Ground on. Oh, wow. Alright, excellent, excellent. Got what I asked for. Man, this card's so nice. Damn. It would be a crime if they don't make a Kyogre one in 4.5 or something. Shiny Star V set. Shiny Star EX or some shiny collection. I forgot what's the actual name, but the shiny Pokemon 4.5. SV 4.5 for us. Although it might be for Japan, yeah, I think they unified the the language for the sets. So now you can see it's like What? Par? Oh well, I thought they would unify the language, but apparently not. Parasol Lady. Well, first box, pretty decent. But for now, let's hope for more. Greed is good. Alright, now we're going to the set. Well, not set, it's the same set, but we're going to the theme and as well as the Mon that I prefer Iron Valiant. Of course, me having said that, you would know that I bought Violet. Okay, let's not let it drop. Alright, very good. The Iron Bundle. Really good for pre-release. But I played badly. Very, very nice. Honestly, it kind of looks painted. Which I like. As well as the sleeves and all that. I mean, there's a dice the same. Oh, just the just the big dice changed. Everything else is the same. Yeah, energies and all that. Alrighty, let us try now. Okay, I'm just gonna see what I want. Tulip or Mela? Can we get their alt art? Can we get Iron Valiant? Wait, let me just double check what's in the set. I'll use the Iron Valiant book. <laughs> For good luck. Oh, I want the Steelix. Yes, yes, I want the Steelix. Chantal, Tulip, Omela, they're all fine. I want the uh, alt arts here, if possible. Or Iron Valiant, that'll be good too. Oh, Terrier has alt art. So I did get the lower rarity one, I wasn't sure. But yeah, okay. Now that we've declared it, let's see if we really can materialize it. Because so far I've been saying, like, you know, oh, it'd be great if I get this, and I get it. So it's like, well, if I had to choose. Iron Valiant, alright? So give me Iron Valiant 
SIR, alternate art, whatever, is however you say it. Oh. <laughs> oh, right off the bat. Come on, man. Come on, man. Why are you going to do this to me? Uh, <laughs> Hopefully, this is not the only hit. What the hell? What the hell is this? <laughs> all the gachoms in the world, dude. What the hell is with all these gachoms? Oh my god. It's fate, man. I mean... I mean, I have Cynthia there, but like... But really? Really? I... <laughs> I... Okay. I don't know if that's a sign, but... I guess I'm playing a Gachom deck now. <laughs> like, wow. I did not expect that. Oh, I ran out of sleeves. But luckily, I have one. One more. Sitting right here. Right off the bat. Right off the bat. Swinging. Okay. <laughs> That was a shocker. I was like, gold? Oh man. Then I saw it was a Pokemon. I was like, oh wait, Iron Valiant. Go Iron Valiant is still not bad. And then it came out. I saw the Gabite and I was like, no. <laughs> We're gonna do this. <laughs> I'm getting all the Raging Surf. All the darn Raging Surf. Surf Pokemon. Why? Why? Does, does it want me to go Raging Surf? Like, literally? Let's take it still. Wow, what the hell is that? So, this makes it my third Garchomp, yes. Including the Booster Box. Although I seem to recall pulling another one. Am I, did I pull? No, 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 no. With, no, I couldn't have used it in a pre-release because I wouldn't have the Gibo and Gabite. Minior! Nice, I like it, but I already have one. And despite how I like it, I'm quite sure it's cheap. Man, because usually, okay, let's just explain how I open packs. So basically, I just open for the sake of opening. I don't really aim to collect because these days, especially, the cards are quite cheap. So you can just buy it straight. But at the very least, I still want to, you know, Reduce the damage, so to speak. I want to get some defenses up. Reduce the damage. Cover my grounds. So I've been hoping to get some of the more... More variety. Either more variety or... Get some of the more expensive ones so that I don't have to buy them to complete my set. But so far... I've been getting dupe after dupe. I've been duped. <laughs> Palkia. Man, that's a hope. I was thinking that. I was hoping that wasn't the only hit, but honestly. A 3 gold star rarity and an AR, I think it's pretty much blank. Any more would be like extras. And it would make this box pretty godlike. In terms of the rates, in terms of the rates. Let's not speak of SAR or whatever, but pretty decent rates, I'd say. Parasol lady, come on, can we get a trainer? Can we get no 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 I gotta be unspecific. Can we get a Mila? Tulip? Parasol lady? Shanto? Anyone? I can't I keep summoning them man, I keep summoning. Summoning is complete. I live to serve. If you know who says that line. Oh, double iron moth. Mm -hmm. 
Three packs left. Disaster. This is so sad. Why do I keep getting dupes? Oh. No, it can't be. As these two are the foils. But. Altaria. A dupe again. I'm pretty sure there are more EXs than that, right? <laughs> I guess I'm running a deck. We got one EX, one AR, and one Secret Rare. So I think that should be it for this box. Extras are very, very welcome. More ARs or something? That being said, maybe I can set the mini up for trading. Hopefully, it's on par with some of the other cards so I can trade it without losing, without spending. Aya, come on, Aya, 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 whatever. Aya. <laughs> what? EX. Terrestrialize. Who? Mewtwo! My friend! Okay, I can use him for the deck. Well, that's about it. Uh, well, I mean, it's pretty darn good. I'm just a little bit salty that, like, I kept pulling dupes. <laughs> Dude, this is... What? <laughs> but alright, we got a Groudon. This is the only new... These two are the only new ones. And this is like a copy of this, so... And this is... These both are dupes from the booster box. Uh, but that aside... Two per box. If this is the normal rate, it's actually pretty damn good. I would recommend trying it then. But then again, this is the Pokemon Center, so it has 10 packs. So the ratio maybe is around there. I do acknowledge that my rates are pretty damn good. It's just the cards that I pull are... You know, if I pull no ARs, but just one SAR, I think that would have been okay. Or if I just pull like half of this, but it's just like one... But it's just like one uh, SAR and one AR. I would be fine with that. But if it's all dupes except for one AR, you know. <laughs> that makes it very hard for me to complete my set, damn it. But yeah, I think it's pretty good. And of course, we can't forget the reason why we bought these ETBs. The Scream Tail and Iron Bundle. Go out and get yourself some past and future boxes, alright? And I'll see you all next time. Bye.